what's up welcome back for another video today well this has been moved from over there so that means shop must be getting worked on yes today's video the shop gets worked on process poles are getting dropped I'm gonna show you all the process right now the dude has left so I'm now able to film I believe he's left for the day that's my assumption is he has left for the day he'll be back tomorrow I don't know yes so let's show y'all what we got going on y'all see a pole yes sir he started working he has concrete he's concrete oh man he left screws um, his shovel and his post hole digger and then his yarn he also left his yarn and that's what kind of leads me to believe he might be coming back but I don't know let's just you know small sneak peek y'all probably don't see the paint video before you see this But, you know, he's concreting it. Looking good. We're coming out 12 feet. Y'all get drone footage in these shop videos. Kind of starting to come out. Oh, We've been ready. But it's happening. He's left these. So, maybe he'll be coming back today. But, nails, screws, and that type of stuff is left. Oh, he left his battery charger, so he's definitely going to be coming back. This is the inside. I'm trying not to scratch the paint on that go-kart. This is what we're looking with. This is what we're working with. Or kind of giving y'all a visual. As y'all see, the inside of this shop is completely gutted and ready for them. Everything's right here. So... He did leave his batteries, but he took the door and drill and driver. So, <laughs> but we're getting ready. So right here, we're going to be doing a three-foot door, the bench, toolbox, three-foot door, and it's going to be padlocked to like air conditioner is going to be going in that window over there. Yes, our shop is finally getting worked on. Poles have been dropped. Incredible. <laughs> Got some concrete right here. You see we're concreting these poles. Yeah. This board's here to tie these in. Kind of letting them stay straight. Yeah, looking good. Um, this thing is very off center, but the ground's very unlevel, so really looking good. We got some touch up to do again on that door go kart. Ugh, I'm getting tired of touching it up. Lean tube's going all the way out, so. That's a bonus. I think he'll be dropping the other pole right here. So, yeah. And I'll be moving bikes accordingly. Just what I do. Which if y'all aren't following me on Instagram, go follow me on Instagram. At iflit underscore yt. 
y'all get to see this the days of and patreon too um i'm starting to believe he actually just went for lunch break guys because he's going to be concreting all the poles from the looks of it because he's got a lot of concrete left so i'm kind of thinking he just went to go to lunch break which is perfectly fine by me that's cool by me because that gives me an opportunity to come out here and film it y'all see i'm super happy about this i'm excited because me and my dad have been waiting three months almost we've just been ready for this y'all know we've been stressed up in there our tensions are just super high because it's so cramped and now we won't be although give it about three months and then we'll probably be wanting to expand again at that point we'll most likely be building another shop if we ever need to again which i don't see us because we're moving in toward the business state we had our first business so yeah So my dad's box is going to end up right there. And, but I think he's just went to lunch right because he's going to have to concrete all of this. At the end of the day, he's going to have to concrete every pole. And that's just kind of that. So. But, oh, come on, work with me. But make sure y'all smash that like button and stay tuned, because in this video, polls get dropped, and um, obviously, framing begins. That should be what's in this video, hopefully. We're going to get my dad's reaction to what all got done on camera. So, y'all. Y'all stay tuned for that. We're going to be getting his reaction. Hopefully, maybe. We'll see. Uh, I think he went to lunch break. Edgar's note. Cut out the, all the lunch break stuff in this. But guys, I got bugs all around me. I'll catch y'all whenever the framing starts. Uh, you maybe drone footage of what gets done today. We'll be done later. I'll catch off an update whenever more than just three poles are dropped. Woo! It's going, buddy. <laughs> okay, guys. So, let me turn y'all again. So, the shop has been gotten a lot of progress since y'all have seen it. Framing has begun. He started framing up yesterday. He wasn't planning on it, but he did. So, I get to show y'all. What the shop's going to look like? Let me go enter through the big door where the big door is going to be. Yes, y'all can see some framing, but the big door is going to be right here. So let's just enter through it and boom, we're in our new shop. As y'all can see right there, there's the opening. That's where we're going to have a door. We're going to have a standard door there. And our big doors are going to be moving straight out. Same doors. But we're going to be changing our locking system to the inside. What we're going to have. Y'all see. He dropped five poles yesterday. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. My butt came back here and dug some poles yesterday. My dad dug this one. He dug about a half a foot. I dug this one 18 inches. Pure rock. But this is going to be another pole back here for the lean to. Right, I got to go trim that up today. And I'll be digging this today. With these old school pole diggers. I'll see pure concrete. You, you can. It's sturdy. Yeah, a little concrete here. We're leaving it. We don't care. I might break it up the sledge. We're concrete in, concrete setting. I really do have a slight problem with this amount of concrete because to me this one just don't have enough concrete. But I'm not the contractor, so I ain't gonna make that call. But you see what our shop's gonna look like. So you can see what our shop's going to look like. I just took thumbnail pictures. But you can see kind of what it's going to look like. You're, you're able to see stuff. 
this big hole is going to go right here so we already started digging I'm going to true it up I'm going to verify the nine with the other poles before I do it but you see we kind of got poles here and I will be dropping this short pole this hole when it's dug and then this pole I won't I might drop into this one when it's dug that way he can come back and take care of that and concrete in all he knew was I was going to dig them not drop poles for him well, hopefully we get a discount <laughs> y'all see the concrete right there but shop is coming out very very well framing has begun and poles have been dropped he won't be back till about maybe Thursday when he comes again he'll concrete these poles if he even concretes them because they're just going to be strengthened by being added on to the shop he'll start framing up walls finish framing the walls up and start adding rafters so the next uh, upload you'll see what the rafters you'll see framing completed and wall begins to go up that's going to be the next one so in this one I'll show y'all the poles getting dropped and framing begins next one you'll see framing gets finished and the walls are going up. By walls, I mean roof. More walls, you never know. So that's going to do it for this one. Let's cue something cool at the end. So that way y'all can see what we're at right now. Hopefully it don't fly out, but yeah. That's so cool. If y'all lucky, I might get some drone footage. If not, well, the next clip's just gonna be by. do it for this episode i'm so happy that framing has begun and i'm happy poles have been dropped because now i can actually see what our shop's going to look like of course it's not going to be doubled when it actually frames these are going to get moved over into another spot 
but I want to thank y'all for watching. I hope y'all got drone footage, but maybe not. Um, the drone has been having problems flying out the sky, so if anybody wants to send the drone, please don't. <laughs> That's a joke. Seriously, inside joke. I have a drone, but it's been having problems just dropping out the sky randomly. It was a $200 drone. I knew it. I didn't expect much, but I did not expect it to just drop out the sky like it does. I was honestly expecting just piss poor video quality and picture quality and all that like it has. But for it to actually fly. Not just drop out the sky randomly. So, that's awkward. But that's what you get when you don't get a DJI. DJI drone. But, hey, it is what it is. I'm happy with the drone. It serves a purpose. Probably just won't fly off one battery, but that's going to conclude this one. Framing has begun. Thank you all for watching. Like, share, subscribe, and go get some merch. Link in the description. Yeah, go get you some merch. Don't forget we have this giveaway going on at 250 subscribers or somewhere around 250. And uh, go join Patreon. Because y'all will be getting a video on it today. Today is recorded. Um, I'll see y'all next one.